ready? Yes. <laughs> Merry Christmas! This is my sister, hehe. <laughs> my sister's watching this video, so I have a live studio audience today. I'm super excited for it. But Merry Christmas, you guys. Today is Christmas. Today is the 25th. If you can't tell, I'm actually still very sick. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice. I can hear it in my voice. I had to go to the doctor on Christmas Eve, so that's fun. It's okay. We're not going to let that stop the Christmas spirit. And so today, I am so, so excited to be doing a What I Got for Christmas 2018 haul. And the reason why this video is such a big deal to me is because this is the very first video I ever posted on my channel. This is the first one the first start of Emily Enchanted, if you will. But this is a big deal because, I don't know, my life has just been changed and turned upside down because of YouTube. I now get to make videos and do something that I've always, always dreamed of, and it all started with this. It was all started by a Christmas haul video that I made last year. Without any further ado, let's just get into the haul. I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that I got for Christmas this year. Disclaimer, I'm gonna say this because I have to and everybody else does. I'm not trying to brag. I'm not trying to show off by any means, shape, or form. I'm so grateful for all the presents that I've been given. I'm so grateful for my family. Mom, if you're watching this, Dad, if you're watching this, thank you so much. You're the best. Um, but this is just because I love Christmas hauls and I want to show you guys what I got. And this is a tradition on my channel, so I kind of have to do it anyways. One more thing before we get started. I just hope you guys can appreciate my shirt. It's a Toy Story Christmas shirt, and it's the only thing that they sell that has Jesse on it. Also, I have on PJ pants because, yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's a good one. Now let's actually get started in the video. So first, we're gonna start with all the stocking stuffers. I just have them all in this bag here. This is everything that Santa brought me, super exciting. So we're gonna start off, he brought me some socks and it came, ooh, oh, this. It came with this little like lavender, <laughs> <laughs> lavender scented bag and I'm actually really obsessed with lavender and I think these are lavender and no they're not lavender infused they are they're lavender scented so oh wait they smell really good so some fuzzy socks freaking love socks I hope you all got your socks for Christmas I saw a lot of you guys who actually got my socks for Christmas so that was so exciting that like I made a Christmas present that you guys all got. I loved seeing all your stories. Thank you all, you were the best. I also gave my socks to my mom and my sister, so they got my socks for Christmas, so. <laughs> Anyways, um, next I got this little perfume sample. I'm actually, I've been really obsessed with perfumes, like starting a few weeks ago, and so Santa knew, and so I think he gave me this perfume so I could test it out, see how I like it. Actually, I haven't smelled it yet. I haven't even opened this. Oh, it smells pretty good. Oh, I was really wanting a speaker, and so Santa came in clutch and got me this, like, waterproof speaker, um, which is really cool. I was listening to it. I was watching YouTube videos using my speaker to listen to it, and then the cable it comes with is literally yellow, so I was like, great, love that for me. Santa also came in clutch with some underwear, so um, thanks, man. Oh, also a Starbucks gift card because I literally go to Starbucks, like, every day now. Some heat pads, a foot scrub to cleanse, exfoliate, massage, and moisturize my feet. Woohoo. Santa, oh, this is my scrunchie. <laughs> Santa came in clutch with the scrunchies. He gave me so many scrunchies. Like, so many of them. There's a lot more in this bag, and then I'm wearing one in my hair. But you know, you know what happened? So Santa decided to give me and my sister a bunch of scrunchies, which is really cool and like nice him. I love scrunchies. I now have way too many scrunchies. But you know what he did? He gave my sister a really cool yellow scrunchie, and he didn't give me one. My sister is a little Grinch, and you know what she did? She decided, after me begging and pleading so nicely to have the yellow scrunchie, she's not giving it to me. She's literally keeping it for herself, and she will not give me her yellow scrunchie. And I'm so upset about it. And then I told my mom about this, and my mom said that Santa probably did that. That way I could branch out and get some variety and get some things that aren't yellow and so we can learn how to share and come up with a compromise and I don't know some Christmas lesson I guess I've learned because I didn't get a yellow scrunchie and my sister did I don't know all I'm saying is Santa that was kind of rude Santa is so sweet and he gave us each every year he always gives us like a little card with like some money in it and so of course of course my card is a Mickey Mouse and it just has some money inside so thanks Santa oh Santa also gave me some lip balm because my lips are so trapped <gasps> Wait, and it's red and white. This, oh, it's peppermint flavored. Oh, I, oof, oof, oof. Vaseline, rosy lips one as well. 
<laughs> oh, he also got me this Kiehl's like skincare um, box, which is really cool. So it's like a face wash, um, moisturizer, just a bunch of like Kiehl stuff, like a headband, like a beauty headband that I can wear like while washing my face and stuff. Oh, a car charger, because I really needed one of these. So that's all the stocking stuffers. We're just gonna start with all the presents. So um, my aunts every year, they always give me and my siblings Amazon gift cards. So thank goodness for this. I know I'm gonna try to buy a new phone case with this because um, let me just show you guys my phone case really quick. So it was like this whole gel thing, right? And then I ended up just picking it all off. So this is what's left of the phone case. By the end of the day, this will probably be gone. So I need a new phone case. And then my sister got me this pumpkin icing body wash. Ooh, it's shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. Yeah, I love philosophy, but she knows how much I love the scent pumpkin. So now I can sell like it all year round. Thanks, Elle. My dad, he really popped off with this gift. I was so excited and not expecting this when I opened it. But it's a blanket, but they're the aliens from Toy Story. And so all over the blanket is the aliens, and it says, ooh. I was wearing this all morning. It's so cozy. <clears throat> Oh, that's gross. So another big theme for this Christmas was shoes. I have literally worn my Adidas Superstars to the core. They are so dirty and I need a bunch of new shoes. And so that's what I got. My mom, she knew how badly I needed shoes. So she got me these Fila shoes, which I'm so obsessed with. All of my favorite YouTubers and Instagrammers, I've seen them all wear these shoes. And I like them because they're very tall. They have quite a bit of a heel. And that's good because I'm very short. And so I can wear these in like, say like an inch or two. I could be like 5'5 five five walking around, which is really fun. And I definitely needed a new pair of white tennis shoes. And then next are these Zara shoes. One day when I was in Disney Springs, when I went to the Zara store, that's where I got my black hat. I also saw these shoes and I think they are the coolest shoes ever. They're kind of like Yeezys. It's a soft material. And so they're very, very comfortable and they just slide right on your feet. It's like wearing socks, but they're super fashionable. And I needed a new pair of like nice shoes that are not like tennis shoes. Last but not least to complete the shoe collection i asked for these just wait for it yellow vans i asked for these yellow vans because i figured i probably need a pair of yellow shoes and i really like vans and i haven't had a pair of vans since i was in like middle school and so my sister she actually wears vans all the time and she inspired me to get these i don't really know how to style them with them being yellow but i feel like it might be a little bit easier than i think so we'll see but i'm super excited to wear these like to disney world be super on brand all the time and they're not white all the shoes i own are white i have white birkenstocks white adidas white converse everything is white so these add a little bit of color to my shoe collection and then from my aunt she got me some tori birch perfume which is super bougie i was super excited about this because like i said i'm really into perfume i used to never wear perfume literally i would just spray myself with some bath and body works like winter candy apple and call it a day but now that i'm older and i'm trying to mature a little bit i figured i should be a big girl and wear some big girl perfume and my mom wears perfume like all the time but like fancy perfume and so this christmas she got some cartier perfume which is super bougie um and it came with like a little sample and so she gave me the sample so now i can wear killer cartier perfume too thank you <laughs> next um that really applies to every situation. Next, we have the Black Friday finds. If you guys watched my Black Friday haul, then you will hopefully remember all of these. Now I get to finally wear them and take them home. I'm so excited. So I got this striped shirt on Black Friday from PacSun. This is from Brandy Melville. And then next, we have this dress, which is so cute. I'm still so obsessed with it. This is from Francesca's, and I think I'm actually going to wear this on New Year's Eve. My plan is to wear this dress with my new Zara booties, maybe some tights if it's cold. Honestly, don't know where I'm spending New Year's Eve. Could be in Texas, could be in Disney World. I have no idea yet. And then last from Black Friday was this belt. I'm so excited. I do not own any belts, so I can't wait to actually have a belt. Then actually in my stocking, I forgot, I got some Morphe stuff, which is really, ooh. Literally, that looks so bad. And so I got this metallic heat eyeshadow. It's like a, a liquid eyeshadow, which I actually have one of them on right now. So I put the red one on. I really like the idea behind it. I don't know that I put it on well 
or that I really know how to put it on well so it might take some practice because it's like liquid and so I'd like use my finger and then it kind of all comes off I don't know so it comes with this red one comes with this darker one which might be a little too dark for me but then also a really pretty gold one also I got a morphe highlighter palette which I'm also wearing right now I'm wearing a red highlight and I don't really know how I feel about a red highlight because my blush is already pretty pink and then my eyeshadow is red so I don't think that was the best decision. I wanted to be festive for the holidays and so this is what it looks like. A bunch of really pretty highlighters. So my parents got me a hard drive. This was a huge thing I was asking for for Christmas and that way I can clear all of my laptop away and be able to edit videos and not worry about running out of space and oh, it creates a big mess. My brother got me a Sephora gift card. I'm super excited with this. I think what I want to get is so right now I use the Urban Decay Quick Fix setting spray. It's like the hydrating one and I really like that so I want to get a full size of that because I just have like a little sample and then I really want to get probably new foundation I use the milk makeup but that foundation shade I have it on but it just isn't really my shade I really want to get a Clarisonic too last but not least is a present that you all might think that I'm very bougie for getting which I am I am it's something that I just really really wanted the biggest thing on my list kind of a meme but also kind of not really all the time i joke about like gucci all the time i'm like oh my god i need some gucci slides haha -ha. oh my god i need a gucci belt to flex on people haha -ha. it's all a joke but also not really i would love gucci slides and i would love a gucci belt etc etc so i just i just want to disclaim this and so i like joke about gucci all the time but i'm joking about it because like i would really like to have it it's just also kind of really expensive and i don't quite have that coin yet so for this christmas i asked for Gucci and um, I didn't really get that many presents for Christmas this year because I asked for this because she was very expensive but I would just like to show you a new addition to my family is this Gucci purse I am so flippin excited for this oh okay <laughs> Well, here's the inside. It's like floral and really, really pretty. I got a Gucci purse. I am so, so blessed and thankful that my parents were willing to get this for me. I just have been really wanting like a nice, a nice purse. And I don't like huge bags. I bring my long champ, my little backpack with me everywhere I go. And I like my long champ. It's great for the parks, but like I'm not trying to carry a backpack with me everywhere I go. I'm kind of sick of it. My long champ is dirty. It's like I don't know it's not as cute of an accessory anymore and so i've been really wanting just like a really nice purse that i can take with me anywhere if i'm going to a nice dinner if i'm going to a nice store like basically anywhere that's not disney if i'm going to a cute coffee shop and i need a cute bag i'm so blessed i got a gucci bag i cannot wait to take this everywhere so like i said i probably won't be bringing this to disney with me because i just feel like I'm, I'm not trying to ruin this at Disney World. Still use my long champ for that. But literally anywhere else. Catch me wearing my Gucci bag and flexing a little bit because I'm so excited to get this. And I just thought it was really, really cute. It's really simple. It's like subtle Gucci, you know what I mean? That is everything that I got for this Christmas 2018. I am so thankful and blessed that I was able to receive so many presents. Definitely didn't need any of them, but I am so lucky that I have such a wonderful family who is just so too good to me and my siblings. So... Thank you guys again so much for that. Comment down below what you got for Christmas. I would love to know like what is the best thing you got. If you got my socks, let me know down below. I love seeing all your stories, but for sure comment as well. I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas day and I will see you guys in the new year. Happy 2019, guys. It's gonna be a great year. Like I said, I'm gonna make another video and it's gonna be all about just like life updates, what's going on, what's gonna happen to my channel, etc, etc. So be on the lookout for that. Probably January 1st is when I'll have that up. But in until then, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to give it a like down below and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and turn on my bell for post notifications because sometimes my videos don't come on. I guess sometimes I feel like that happens. So if you turn on the post notifications, that is the best way to be notified whenever I post a video. My sister's literally laughing at me over there. Life of a YouTuber. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. If you don't celebrate Christmas, happy holidays. I hope you had a wonderful Tuesday. Um, maybe you, was, you had some good food today. I don't know. I really wanted canes today, and it was closed, so that was a bummer. Love you. Okay, bye. Thanks. <laughs> okay. That's when it's Christmas time again. Light's out, light's out, light's out.